take a screenshot of it so it goes in the camera roll and then use that instead of the written poster. This project is a video that we made about the stages of multiplication and what we're doing is taking what we learn from everyday math. This is multiplication. We're applying that to create videos to share with other kids. It fits into 21st century learning because what we're focusing on is collaboration with a partner. Um, they're working on creativity skills, how to make a video, an instructional video, interesting. I guess it could be kind of hard with like showing how you do it. I mean, everybody may do it differently. It was kind of a little weird at first, but then I got like, I got used to making the different clips. Like, it took us, like, 10 minutes to make each little clip, and, and then we got a 3 minutes and 48 second video. We put, like, a multiplication graph in our PowerPoint, and we recorded sound, and so I think they would understand it a little bit more. iMovie, you can um, take different clips of it. Well, instead of just have like, you can have it all on hand before, so if, in case you make any mistakes, then you don't have to make the mistakes in front of the class. You can make them on here and then you can just change the mistakes. We're gonna see how to do multiplication and how we do it, how Andrew does it, and some strategies. I've had this group make videos before, but what we did what's really cool is meet with the third grade class focus group and that third grade class gave us feedback on the videos, how informative they were, were they creative, was the math accurate, and then we took that feedback and made our videos better, and then after that we met with the fifth grade class, and we did the same process. Creativity four, informative three. They would give us a sheet back with all this stuff that, how many stars would you rate this? When we went with the fifth graders, they, um, they gave us a lot of feedback, and then we changed little things, but then, um, then I think we made our video pretty perfect. Well, they said we were pretty creative, the third grader said, and the fifth grader said um, we should be more creative. I realized it's not really that tricky to make a video. It's kind of e almost easier than making, than just presenting something to the class because you can have everything here and you know how much time you have to make it. <laughs> 